Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I love Loopy's Crochet and Treasures. If you're new to my channel, my name is Tracy. I live in Alabama and I love to crochet and I love yarn. And um, I also have an Etsy shop. I make stitch markers and earrings and necklaces and all kinds of stuff. So I'll leave uh, my Etsy shop in the description box of this video if you want to check it out. I want to thank everyone who's ever purchased from me. It really helps me out a lot. And I also want to thank the ones who always go over and favorite things in my shop because that helps to get me out so more people can find me. And, uh, and I want to thank everyone who's ever wrote a, this wrote beautiful um, reviews on my Etsy shop. I, I really, really appreciate it. Uh, but I'm going to show a few necklaces I've made and a, some more uh, things that I've made. And then I have a, um, a yarn haul. Um, so, uh, if you want to stick around for that, I appreciate it. And um, I hope you all are having a wonderful, wonderful week. I know it's been a while since I've been on, uh, but, you know, you get busy sometimes or you're not feeling good. So, anyway, I'm here now. <laughs> and uh, I want to welcome all my new subscribers. I hope you like you here and I hope you stay. And I want to say thank you to all of you who always come back and watch my videos because it really means a lot to me. And also, I picked the winner of my give, my 5K giveaway if you want to see who won. And um, I want to congratulate the winner. It was Brenda um, McComas or something like that. So I hope she sees the video and, and I hope she uh, claims her prize. So, uh, but let's just jump in. I guess I'll show you my yarn stuff first, and then I'll show you my necklaces and some things that I've made. But I, I ordered some yarns from Joann's that I wanted to try. Um, they were, some of them were a little bit pricey, so I don't, I doubt I ever purchase them again unless they really go on sale. <laughs> some of them I like, some of them I wasn't too crazy about. But I ordered this Big Twist Reverb. I don't think I've ever had this before. Now, I may have, but I don't think I have. But I love this color. And um, so I think it was Nancy. It, she's got yarn, too. But she showed this colorway in one of her videos. And if y'all don't know Nancy, please go over and watch her. You'll love her. She's from Florida, and she's she's got great content. And uh, she's just a, a great person, and I know that you'll love her, so go check her out. It's, uh, she's got yarn, too, and I'll leave it in the description box. But she was showing this colorway, and I thought it was so pretty. So I only got this colorway. They got a 311 yards on them, and it's called Big Twist Reverb. So, very pretty. I think they were $4.49 a piece, so I think they were on sale. And um, so I got two of them. So I wanted to try them. They're really soft. It's a number four. Uh, it says machine washable, low iron, do not bleach, do not tumble dry, dry flat. But it's 100% um, premium acrylic. And it's really, really soft. And this colorway is called Pink Brown Mix. So I like that. It's real pretty. And uh, so I might buy that again. But let me get this stuff out of this box and put it up here on the table. Um, and let y'all know what all I got here. It's uh, fancy yarns, as I call them. <laughs> Not, you know, kind of pricey. So, but I wanted to try them, and they were on sale. But still, even on the sale price that I got them, um, they were a bit pricey. So, I don't know if I'll buy them again. Not like I said, unless they're having a really good sale. But I'll show you the one I really wasn't crazy about. And it come from, I mean, I love the yarn and everything, and it's pretty, but uh, let's see what I paid for this. $12.99. $12.99, y'all, for this. And I know it's pretty and everything, and it's called Sunset Lovers, and um, it's from um, Darn Good Yarn, and it's a number four worsted one-ply, and... Just say 75 yards, y'all, for $12.99. Now, it's beautiful, but I, I doubt I ever buy that again because of the price. But look how pretty it is. And, um, 
darn, darn good yarns. Very pretty though. And the colorway Sunset Lovers. Then I got two of each of these, I think. This is darn good yarn too. And uh, it was $12.99. And it's uh, recycled silk. It's got 200 yards on it. And uh, it's called Rainbow. And it's, uh, I think that's about all it tells you. It's a fine number two. And it's recycled silk in the rainbow color, which is very pretty. Is this it? Yeah. It's very pretty. So it's 400 yards. And they were $12.99. So, yeah. I don't know if I do that again either. I mean, it's pretty. And I love silk. And this is the same thing, but it's a, a zero zero lace um, and unicorn cloud and it's a recycled silk 300 yards on each one I think I'm going to make a shawl with this so pretty and then I got two of these from KC um, they were this is the uh 94% cotton and 6% Lurex. It was um, $12.99. And they have, it's Tutti Fruity. And 437 yards. And I said 94% cotton, 6% Lurex. It's very pretty. And it's got sparkle. I hope you, I think you can see the sparkle. So, I got two of those. And then I got, this is uh, the 100% cotton. It was $9.99. Now, I might buy this again. Um, the price wasn't too bad. Um, it's a super, super fine number one. Pink speckles the colorway. And it's 100% cotton, 472 yards on each one. So, that'll make a beautiful sh uh, shawl. Ain't that pretty? It's Casey hand dyed. And then I got two. Uh, this is 100% cotton. They were $9.99. Uh, this is the colorway rainbow. The same specs as that other one. Pretty. Ain't that pretty? You know, $9.99 ain't too bad for for uh, hand-dyed yarn. So, but that was my haul from Joann's. Um, didn't get a whole lot. It's just some of the yarns that I wanted to try. And they were, like I said, on sale, but not, uh, they wasn't a real, real good sale. But I wanted to try them, so I did. So I've got that over with. <laughs> but that's $12.99. For 75 yards. I don't know, y'all. Silk yarn? I I don't know. I just I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but it's pretty. Okay, let's see. Now I'm gonna show y'all some things that I made. First I'll show you my necklaces that are on my Etsy shop at the moment. I sold a few of them. But this is the one that's in that give this is one like the one in the giveaway um, box that I just picked a winner for. And it's just a um, uh, tannish, off whitish color, and with all different beads on it. It's real pretty. I like it. That's on there. And then I got one I made with gray and coral. It's very pretty. That's on there. And then I made another red, white, and blue. I've sold quite a few of these. Just hadn't made any lately. But ain't that pretty? Red, white, and blue. And then I have a... It's a light blue and a purple. Purplish color. So pretty. These beads, it's just sometimes the way you turn them, they look blue. And some look purple. It's real pretty. 
And all the beads on my necklaces are glass beads. But that's on there. Okay, that's my necklaces. In case you're wondering, this is a shawl I showed on a, another video uh, by Bag o Day that I made. And um, it's just a shawl because I'm pretty sure somebody's going to ask. But ain't it beautiful? That might be what I made with that silk yarn because I love this pattern. Ain't that pretty? So that's by Crystal over at Bag O'Day, which I do a lot of her patterns because I, I love everything she does. Oh, I made a lovey that's in my Etsy shop. Have I put it in my Etsy shop? No, I don't think I put it in there yet, but I'm going to. But um, it's a monkey. Ain't he cute? And this is this lovey. You, you crochet around a, a hair bow. And um, the pattern is by Zelda over at NRJ3. And uh, I'll leave it in the description box. And I always use her, you know, go by her pattern. But I usually put different borders on mine. Um, whoops. And you could throw these in the wash. And you just crochet around the little hairband thing. And you make the little lovey. And the monkey is so soft. It's so, uh-oh. He's shedding a little bit. Well, probably for me pulling that thing off. Yeah, but he is so adorable. Look at him. So keep a lookout for that, and I'll have him on my Etsy shop soon. Put him over here. Okay, and then the last time on my video, well, I don't think I showed you this one. This is the stitch tutorial by Crystal over at Bag O'Day. Um, it's just a stitch tutorial, so I made a blanket with it using um the ice cream yarn and the colorway strawberry strawberry it's a lightweight number three a hundred percent acrylic and it has 1117 yards on it and um it's a lightweight number three uh, i think it's a hundred percent acrylic let's see did i say that yeah a hundred percent acrylic so i used that and i made like a baby blanket it's so cute I love that pattern. It's it's uh beautiful. Look at that. And I just let it go like it wanted to go. The colors and all. So ain't that pretty? It's kind of dark on that side and light on that side. Now I just used a, a border I put on it. It's like a, a little bitty shell border something simple but ain't that stitch just beautiful I love it so I made that and then I made let's see I have to get you off of here then I made let's see with a Then I made this. It's like a, I don't think I've showed this. Um, this is like a V stitch, I think. And it might be by Crystal, but I'll leave the, if, if I used a pattern, I'll leave it in the description box. But I made this blanket. Ain't that pretty? I love those colors. It's like a coral yellow and white. And um, I think I used the crab stitch for the border. And then this is the yarn I use. Sweet Rolls. By Premier. And the color is uh, Citrus Pop. 245 yards. Um, let's see. 100% acrylic. A medium four. So that's what I used on that. So, let me put that back over here. And then this other blanket, I think I showed y'all last time, but I hadn't finished it. But I finally finished it. I just got to weave in my ends on all my stuff. Uh, but I put the wave, bo uh, wave border on it. I don't think I had the border on there 
uh, when I showed it to you before. But I put the wave border around it. I think it come out really pretty. And uh, I think this is just a V stitch too. So look at those colors. It makes me think of the beach. It's very pretty. Now some of these, if they're the right size, I may donate to um, Foggy Creek. Um, the, the one that she's got yarn too, takes up the blankets for and delivers to them. Um, so I'll, I'll leave um, her video um, explaining that too. Uh, okay, let's see. Now the yarn I used on that was Darius Jumbo yarn I got from Bargain Hunt. And it is called Light Gray Beige. Then I used Big Twist in the white. I think it's Big Twist. No, it's not. Karen One Pounder. And the white color. And the blue part of it is Red Heart with Love. And the color iced aqua and then I use the red heart super saver in the color mushroom and then that's it that's what I used on that blanket so all right y'all I just wanted to get on and share a few things with you and let you know I had forgot about you <laughs> It's just been a few days since I've put a video out. I've kind of lost my projo a little bit. Uh, I made the blankets and stuff. I just needed something that I really didn't have to think about while I'm crocheting. I don't know. I just can't get motivated to crochet. I, I hope it straightens out. Because <laughs> I love to crochet. It's very nice and relaxing. Um, but I don't know. I just kind of been under the weather a little bit maybe that's why um so but i i, I hope y'all all are doing wonderful uh and i want to thank the the ones of you who entered by giveaway that really meant a lot it was like 348 um entries so that was really really good and so but my husband's been working a lot lately he uh and he's getting too old for all them hours, but they they have like a shutdown. They have and they have to work just about every day. So y'all keep him in your prayers that he can get through this and everything. And so um, I guess that's about it. I love you guys, and I hope to be back on again soon. Y'all take care and. Um, Hopefully my next video will be a little more interesting. So if you're new, please come back or watch some of my other videos. Uh, this was, I, I mean, I have done a little bit, but not a lot. And um, so, but I'm going to get back in the swing of things here shortly, I hope. Y'all take care and, and uh, I love you all so much. Talk to you later. Bye.